Neptune, the eighth planet from our sun, is a world of mystery and wonder. This gas giant cloaked in azure hues lurks in the distant reaches of our solar system. Four times wider than Earth, Neptune is a realm of icy clouds and powerful storms. Its atmosphere is a turbulent mix of hydrogen, helium, and methane. It is the methane that gives Neptune its distinctive blue color. Neptune holds the title of the windiest planet in our solar system. Winds whip around the planet at unimaginable speeds, far surpassing anything we experience on Earth. These winds drive massive storms, some even larger than our entire planet. Neptune also boasts a faint ring system, made up of icy particles and dust. Unlike the inner rocky planets, Neptune is a gas giant, meaning it lacks a solid surface. Its atmosphere gradually transitions into a slushy interior composed mostly of water, ammonia, and methane ices. Deep within Neptune's core lies a rocky heart, likely similar in size to Earth. Neptune's immense distance from Earth, coupled with its dimness, makes it a challenging target for observation. For centuries it remained hidden from human view, unknown and unexplored. It wasn't until 1846 that astronomers using mathematical predictions finally pinpointed Neptune's location. In the vast expanse of space, collisions are a fact of life. Asteroids, comets, and even entire planets can collide with each other, reshaping the cosmic landscape. Recently, the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, our most powerful eye in the sky, detected evidence of a massive collision involving Neptune. This wasn't a glancing blow. The evidence suggests a head-on collision between Neptune and a large celestial object, possibly a rogue planet or a massive comet. The impact released an incredible amount of energy equivalent to thousands of nuclear bombs detonating simultaneously. This cosmic crash left a noticeable scar on Neptune's atmosphere, visible as a bright glowing spot in JWST's observations. The impact site, located in Neptune's southern hemisphere, spans thousands of kilometers. It's a testament to the sheer power of this cosmic event. Scientists believe the impactor, whatever it was, was completely obliterated, its remnants absorbed into Neptune's atmosphere. This collision is a stark reminder of the dynamic nature of our solar system. It shatters the illusion of a static and unchanging cosmos, revealing the constant dance of celestial objects, their orbits intertwined in a delicate balance. Collisions on such a grand scale are incredibly rare events, occurring only once in a blue moon. In the billions of years since our solar system formed, only a handful of such impacts are believed to have occurred. These events have shaped the very fabric of our cosmic neighborhood. That's why the recent collision on Neptune is so significant. It stands out as a monumental event in the history of our solar system. It offers us a unique opportunity to study the aftermath of a catastrophic cosmic event and gain insights into the processes that shape planets and solar systems. By examining the data, scientists can unlock secrets about planetary dynamics and evolution. The odds of witnessing such an event in our lifetime are astronomically small. It's a rare cosmic spectacle that few generations get to observe. It's like winning the cosmic lottery, except the prize is a wealth of scientific data. This data can lead to groundbreaking discoveries and advancements in our understanding of the universe. By studying the impact's effects on Neptune's atmosphere, rings, and moons, we can glean valuable information about the planet's composition, structure, and evolution. This knowledge can also provide clues about similar processes on other planets. Furthermore, this collision provides clues about the early solar system. It acts as a window into the past, revealing the chaotic environment in which our planets were born. The object that struck Neptune was likely a relic from that chaotic period, a survivor of the tumultuous planet-forming era. Studying it can help us understand the conditions that prevailed during the early days of our solar system. By analyzing the impact debris, we might be able to piece together the history of our solar system's formation. Each fragment holds a story, a piece of the puzzle that can reveal the grand narrative of our cosmic origins. This event also highlights the importance of continuous space observation. Constant vigilance allows us to catch these rare events and study them in detail. Without JWST's watchful eye, this collision would have gone unnoticed. A silent drama playing out in the depths of our solar system. Advanced technology enables us to witness and analyze these cosmic phenomena. It underscores the need for advanced telescopes and space missions to monitor the cosmos and unravel its secrets. These tools are essential for expanding our knowledge and understanding of the universe we inhabit. The impact on Neptune sent shockwaves not just through space but also through the planet's atmosphere. 
This cataclysmic event was a stark reminder of the dynamic and often violent nature of our solar system. The energy released by the collision heated the surrounding gases to millions of degrees, creating a blinding flash of light. This intense burst of energy was visible across vast distances, illuminating the dark expanse of space. This heat also disrupted Neptune's atmospheric circulation patterns, triggering planet-wide storms and altering its weather patterns. The once stable atmospheric currents were thrown into chaos, leading to unprecedented meteorological phenomena. The impact debris, a mixture of vaporized rock and ice from the impactor and Neptune's upper atmosphere, was blasted high above the planet's cloud tops. This debris formed a temporary ring around Neptune, a ghostly reminder of the collision. This material, now caught in Neptune's powerful winds, is being carried around the planet, creating long, streaky clouds that stretch for thousands of kilometers. These clouds, moving at incredible speeds, are a testament to the planet's dynamic weather system. Scientists are particularly interested in studying the composition of these clouds. By understanding their makeup, we can learn more about the processes that govern planetary atmospheres. By analyzing the light they reflect and absorb, we can determine the chemical makeup of the impactor and gain insights into the materials that existed in the early solar system. This spectral analysis is crucial for piecing together the history of our cosmic neighborhood. This information can help us refine our models of planet formation and understand the conditions under which our own planet formed. By comparing these findings with data from other celestial bodies, we can build a more comprehensive picture of the solar system's evolution. The impact also created a massive shockwave that is still propagating through Neptune's atmosphere. This shockwave is a powerful force, reshaping the atmospheric layers as it travels. This shockwave is compressing and heating the gases in its path, creating regions of intense pressure and temperature. These conditions are unlike anything we have observed on Earth offering a unique opportunity to study extreme atmospheric dynamics. These extreme conditions are triggering chemical reactions in Neptune's atmosphere, potentially forming new compounds and altering its overall composition. The study of these reactions could reveal new insights into the chemistry of gas giants and the potential for similar processes on exoplanets. Neptune, like its giant neighbor Saturn, possesses a system of rings, although much fainter and less prominent. These rings are composed of icy particles and dust, likely the remnants of shattered moons or captured comets. The recent collision is sure to have had a significant impact on these delicate structures. The impact debris, blasted into space by the collision, is being pulled in by Neptune's gravity. Some of this material will fall back to the planet, but some will be captured by the rings, adding to their mass and potentially altering their composition. This influx of fresh material could make the rings brighter and easier to observe from Earth. The collision could also disrupt the delicate gravitational balance that keeps the rings in place. The impactor's gravity, even for a brief period, would have tugged at the ring particles, potentially creating waves and ripples that could persist for centuries. These disturbances could provide clues about the impactor's size and trajectory. Scientists are eager to study these changes in Neptune's rings. By observing how the rings evolve in the aftermath of the collision, we can learn more about their dynamics, composition, and origin. This information can help us understand the processes that form and shape planetary rings throughout the cosmos. Neptune's largest moon, Triton, is a world of icy volcanoes and nitrogen geysers. This distant and mysterious moon is a fascinating subject for scientists and space enthusiasts alike. This enigmatic moon, likely a captured object from the Kuiper Belt, orbits Neptune in the opposite direction of the planet's rotation a peculiar characteristic that hints at a violent past. Its retrograde orbit suggests that Triton did not form alongside Neptune, but was instead captured by the planet's gravity, leading to a dramatic and tumultuous history. The recent collision is sure to have sent shock waves through this icy world. Such an event would not only affect Triton's surface but also its internal structure, potentially altering its geological activity. The impact's energy, even at such a distance would have shaken Triton to its core. This immense force could disrupt the moon's crust and mantle, leading to significant geological changes. This shaking could trigger increased volcanic activity on the moon's surface, as molten ice and rock are forced up from its interior. The resulting eruptions could reshape the landscape, creating new features and altering existing ones. It could also awaken dormant geysers sending plumes of nitrogen gas and ice particles soaring high above Triton's surface. 
These dramatic eruptions would be a spectacular sight revealing the dynamic nature of this distant moon. The impact debris scattered across the Neptune system poses a threat to Triton as well. These fragments traveling at high speeds could collide with Triton, causing further disruptions and potentially creating new impact sites. While most of the debris will likely miss the moon, some fragments could collide with its surface, creating new craters and potentially excavating subsurface material. These impacts could expose layers of Triton's crust that have been hidden for eons, offering a glimpse into the moon's ancient past. These impacts could provide insights into Triton's composition and history. By studying the material ejected from these new craters, scientists can learn more about the moon's geological makeup and the processes that have shaped it over time. Scientists are particularly interested in studying Triton's response to the collision. Observations from telescopes and spacecraft can reveal how the moon's surface and atmosphere react to such a significant event. By observing any changes in its volcanic activity, geyser eruptions or surface features, we can learn more about the moon's internal structure, composition and geological processes. These observations can help us understand the forces at work beneath Triton's icy exterior. This information can help us understand the evolution of icy worlds in the outer solar system and beyond. By studying Triton, we gain valuable insights into the history and development of other icy moons and distant celestial bodies, enriching our knowledge of the universe.